This is your classic zero-day exploit, and it's particularly troublesome because it's a previously unknown vulnerability. But not to worry. This is where the VMware Workspace ONE comes into the picture. Let's see the demo. All right, check out how the admin is using Workspace ONE Unified Endpoint Management to manage all kinds of devices and apps in one place. There is physical, virtual, Windows 10, Mac OS, rugged devices, and much more. Now, looks like the admin has just received a notification about that zero-day exploit. All right, now what you're going to see is Workspace ONE Risk Analytics and Carbon Black and see how they're going to work their magic together. Carbon Black is able to report suspicious activity even though this was not a previously known vulnerability. And Workspace ONE, well, it uses sophisticated machine learning models to create a baseline for expected behavior. Any anomaly gets flagged and contributes to a risk score, which can then be used to set up conditional access. So let's see what's going on with these high-risk users that are marked in red. Sure enough, there is a spike in network activity. And if you scroll down, you're going to see that there has been a suspicious login attempt from Langley, and Carbon Black has reported suspicious activity. All this unexpected behavior raises Alice's risk score to high. But Workspace ONE really comes into the picture and provides automated tools to kick in here to remediate. And that's exactly what happened here. The malicious login was prevented, access to secure content was blocked, and a Slack message was sent to IT. Once IT is quarant has quarantined the device, they can safely follow up to ensure that no other device is compromised. And this is how, for the very first time, we have endpoint security with Carbon Black and endpoint management with Workspace ONE together giving us workspace security.